Well, it's part of the test. Now to our big story of the night. An Arizona lawmaker accused of drunk driving will be spending some time behind bars. Cops busting state representative David Cook back in December. He's now changing his plea to lessen the charges. Good evening, I'm Mark Curtis. And I'm Tra I in for Kadeve Devine. Team 12's Nicole Zymek joins us now live from the Alert Center. And Nicole, just how long will Cook be in jail? Well, Tram, not very long. In fact, just one day. It's all part of a deal that the Republican lawmaker from Globe is taking to lessen the charges after DPS troopers say that they caught him driving drunk. How do you plead to that charge? David Cook will be spending 24 hours in unfamiliar surroundings. Did anyone force you to enter into this plea? Uh, no, sir. After striking a plea deal. Authorities initially charging Cook with extreme DUI, which comes with a 30 day sentence in jail. Cook pleading guilty knocks that down to one day in jail and no trial, as long as he completes a drug and alcohol treatment program. Camera right now, you're being audio recorded. Good. A DPS trooper originally stopping Cook in December after reporting seeing his truck slowly drifting across lanes of traffic near Loop 202 and McDowell in Mesa. You watch me pick up my phone from my okay. seat. Cook telling troopers he crossed over lanes because he dropped his cell phone. But troopers pressing for a field sobriety test. Right foot, three left foot. A DPS case report noting his bloodshot eyes. He's kind of all over the place. He's not following directions. Yeah, the odor of alcohol the whole nine yards. Finding two red solo cups and a wine bottle opener inside his truck. Cook's blood alcohol content nearly twice the legal limit. State recommends that the defendant attend a, mat, attend a victim impact panel. Cook has apologized for his behavior on social media. He's slated to self-surrender to jail tomorrow night. We're live in the Alert Center. Nicole Zymek, 12 News at 10. Okay, Nicole, thanks.